them for you. Good lads. There's confirmation of the result. All Latins, the first three. Perhaps the weather suited them rather better than our chaps. But uh, David Thompson, Dave Moorcroft, enjoying the track and field with us this afternoon. I'm amazed they can run at all in that kind of heat, those guys, and finish as well as that. Well, I am, and I was, I was finding it difficult even watching it. And uh, I went out and watched a little bit of the race, and uh, Peter Whitehead said it wasn't that humid. Um, but it was very, very hot. And it is so stupid running at that time of the day when they could run earlier. And it, 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 I mean, Whitehead ran a great race, but just think what might have happened had it been in, in, in weather that, that, that um, Britain's more are, more, are more suitable. But um, whatever, it was a great run and uh, it's so tough. And he was there and he was pushing it on with the very best in the world. And then you know, the way in which Fies and Saron battled it out of the last sort of four or five miles, Saron took it on, Fies came back. And it was a, it was a great event. But for Peter Whitehead, that's magnificent. Right, thank you very much for the moment. We'll be watching the uh, relays shortly. But first, let's show you what happened in the wheelchair 1,500 metres. <laughs> 